Lisa Kim 1114. Um, I thought I would come and do a video on how I actually take the rolls out of my head um, today. So this is the next day. So what I do, I just um, take it off. And I'm going to start in the back of my head and take the rollers out. Um, I'm not going to wear my hair down like this this weekend. Um, this is, I mean, I did a video on this already. I've worn this style already. So you pretty much already know what, it, what it's going to look like. Um, I'm not going to wear my hair down this weekend. Um, I'll probably do a another video tomorrow on the um, style that I'm going to wear. If you watch the the um, video that I had, I'll stop right here. The video that I uh, posted the other day with the celebrity inspired hairstyles on it. I think the, it's the, the hairstyle that I'm planning on wearing is the one, um, I think it was Keisha Knight. Uh, the hairstyle that she had with the bangs. That's the hairstyle I'm planning on doing this weekend. So, um, I'll probably do it tomorrow sometime. I don't think I put enough foam. I don't look like I put enough uh, setting lotion on my hair. It's actually still a little bit wet, but uh, it'll do. It's fine. I don't really care about it rolling extremely tight anyway right now because, it's, like I said, it's gonna be up pent up anyway. So, I don't really care. Yeah, um, I'm thinking. I think I'm gonna put a headband on. I'm gonna wear it down to uh, today when I go out. I'm going out uh, late on, so I'm just gonna. Um, anything I want to carry with just the ends of my hair, really. So, cause like I said, I'm gonna pull it up um, tomorrow in a style. So, um, yeah. So I'm gonna take these rolls out in the middle now, and um, I'm just gonna do that to them. And let them fall. I'll turn around so you can see exactly what I'm doing. Some of my curls in the back, I might have to pull them apart because I don't know exactly how they are yet. So, And if you do, I'm going to turn around now, I think, uh, yeah. So if you do that, it'll cover the part, the little parts that you had. As you can see, it won't be any gaps or anything like that in the back of your head. You pull it apart in the top. So that's one reason why I roll the, the uh, top first, the middle section first. And then I take it out. I roll it first, but I take the rolls out of it uh, last. And you can kind of push it up so you want to, if you want to kind of stand up in the top or whatever. This is the last one right here. Just to come down towards your face, you could leave it like that and just pull it up now. I'm gonna add a headband. I'm gonna wear I'm wearing black and gray later on. I don't know why. Every time I wear these earrings with these when I when I get these braids in my head, I always get them caught. My braids get caught around around the uh, earring. Yeah. Okay now. And I think I might actually do like, since I got it so curly, I'm thinking about doing it up like this. Yeah, I think I will do it like that later on. I got to get some bobbin pins though. Instead of just wearing it straight down, I'm going to actually pin it up. I might pull a few curls out in the front. Maybe. So yeah, I think I'm going to wear it like this later on, maybe. Okay, so I, I put a couple of hair pins. I put two hair pins in there actually. And I just pinned it in the back to see how it looks. And I also finished the back of my hair too, as you can see. I don't know if you can see it with the headband on. The braids. And they, they look fresh back there. So I can pin my hair up and it looks like I, I actually re-braided my whole head. Um. This is one of the headbands that I was talking about you could get um, 
for your hair when your new growth come in. If you wear your hair um, curly and, and with this type of headband, you actually can pull it like right here on the end and cover up your new growth and with the curls in your hair, um, you won't be able to see your new growth. But I, I went around the edges of mine so I actually pulled mine back just a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to finish the rest of the next week. So, This is the way I'm going to wear it today. But like I said, I'm going to do a tutorial on the hairstyle that I'm going to wear this uh, weekend. Um, actually. But uh, some of my hair is um, still kind of damp. The curls didn't dry good. But the ends of it was uh, dry. But the like in the root part, is, it was still damp. That's why some of my curls weren't as tight as they should have been. But I don't really care because like I said, I'm not going to wear it down anyway. So, so yeah, I'm going to wear it like this today. And... Um, I'll probably do some, post some pictures um, of the outfit that I'm going to wear for today um, in a few. So, out the outfit that I'm actually wearing tonight. Um, first off, um, earrings. I'll go start with the earrings. Um, these are the apple bottom earrings that I showed you. I think um, last week sometime I, I didn't wear them, but these are the black ones that I have. I have them in black, red, and clear. I think that's on three colors they come in, but anyway, I got those on and I got the necklace on also. Uh, the chain is gold actually, but um, the rhinestones in it are it's kind of silver like, so I decided to put those on to kind of reflect. Um, I'll take a picture of the necklace and earrings later on and show them. I'll I'll show you all three sets on which ones or uh, how they look. Um, the jacket. I decided to wear the jacket for sleeves purpose because it's probably gonna be a little bit cool, and I wanted to have some sleeves on so. And this is a jacket I put on on top of it. I like wearing um, the short jackets with high waisted pants. I, I don't know. I just like the way it looks. But um, it's just like a just a regular denim jacket um, with some little rhinestones on it. I got on a gray sweater up under here. It's really it's a thin sweater, but um, it's long sleeves, but it's it's extremely thin. And um, I put on this little lace cami top that I showed you in one of my other videos. Um, which I have to show you the, how they actually look. I actually paid a dollar for these. I got these uh, cami tops at Dollar Tree. And I have them in. Um, I got them because they're really thin. And they're cute to put up on some of your shirts. I, I wear, when they get hot. I wear a lot of uh, shirts this year. And you can see through them. So these would be perfect to go up on them. I got it in orange. Uh, hot pink. Dark brown. Navy blue. And I think that's it. And black. But uh, anyway. The uh, belt. Is the same belt that I had on Sunday. I showed you with the uh, top that I had on the black top that I had on. Um, it's an apple bottom belt and it got little silver rhinestones and studs around it. Um, I thought it looked cute on top of the pants. I'm not sure if I'm a word. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wear the belt with it also though. Uh, the pants they're black. Um, they're like trousers kind of, but they're uh, spandex material, so they stretch. They're really extremely comfortable. And you probably can't see it on camera, but they actually have some little pinstripes in them. And the pinstripes are actually silver in them. So that's why I put on the silver belt and all that with it. And the, you can see those cuffs in the ends of, end of the pants also. They're like little cuffs on them. I'm going to pull my pants later so you can see the shoes better. The shoes are actually apple bottom. I don't know if you can see it or not. I'll take a picture of the shoes, a close-up of the shoes. Um, but it has a little apple chain and the chain has some little rhinestones around them. And the end, they got like on them some little chains around the toe part also. And it, the shoes are actually gray. And um, they have the words apple bottom and black all all over them. So, um, yeah, I'll take pictures of the shoes. You can't really see it that good on camera. But I'll, I'll take a picture of the shoes and show, show you the actual shoes. And I actually have, I don't like, let me zoom back out. Okay, there we go. I don't like big purses. I like small purses, but this is the purse that uh, go with the shoes. Um, and they got the Apple Bottom logo written all over too, and they got it um, on the little medallion in the middle of. The pants are having the uh, pockets in the back. They got a zipper like right up the middle of them, and that's it. And they're high waisted in the back as well. So uh, yeah, so that's the outfit that I'm wearing today. Um, Hopefully you like it. Um, let me know what you think. Um, I won't. I don't really do talk about uh, makeup or whatever because I'm not a makeup expert. I don't even know how to pick the right shade for me. 
Oh, uh, but um, if you want to know, <laughs> if you just happen to want to know what kind of makeup I have on, um, uh, I really don't have on much. I just have on like a little light powder, and I forget what color it is. It's uh some kind of type of shimmer by um. Maybelline or CoverGirl. I'm not sure which one it is. I have to check and see. And the uh, eyeliner that I have on is actually, I don't know, it might look white on camera, but it's actually silver glitter that's on my eye. And my lips, I just have on just a light lip gloss. It's got a little shimmery silver like look to it. And um, yeah, so that's it. So hopefully you like it. Uh, let me know what you think, and I will talk to you later, YouTube. Till the end, take care.